This is the travel bag that I've used for forever and a day. So, I thought I'd show you what I like about it. So, just initially, the bag is it's made out of nylon, completely nylon. There's no frame or anything like that in it. Uh, it's got a simple buckle on the outside and this flap that uh, keeps everything covered inside. Some look like a messenger bag. It's got a shoulder strap that is sewn in at both sides. Um, it's adjustable. On the back side, it's got in here a belt, a waist harness, and if you need or want to strap this thing around your around your waist if you're having to move at speed you want to snap that thing on there you can i've taken this bag all over north africa the middle east and parts in between and on pretty much every kona strip that uh, that i make it's got a reinforced bottom with and when i say reinforced that just means that it's got some more of the shoulder material sewn into the bottom uh, so that's the outside of the bag so let's look in the inside so you pop it open, and the first thing you notice is that the inside has got this useful little plastic clear cover on the or cover on it. And I've done everything from put maps inside here uh, to plane tickets, right? Pop the top open, bring this thing down, look at what I need to, and then back together. It's all, it Velcros back together. And now you can obviously see that it's got three uh, pouches in the front that just Velcro shut. Right, they're open through. Uh, they don't have any drain holes, but they're open through. And so I, I carry whatever is required for quick access on the move, uh, moving through an airport or whatever. This goes cross. This whole thing goes crossbody, and I, I wear it. This this whole thing goes over my my body on the left side. So my left arm is managing this bag. And in here, you know, I'll carry. Uh, Maybe my cell phone gets gets popped down in here in a holster so that it clips in and it's not going anywhere. Or, obviously, it'll, it'll hold magazines, right? It'll hold uh, two, uh, two uh, M16 or M4 magazines there. On the side, you've got two more uh, pockets, and I've got a rat's tourniquet in one side. And you guys know I love the rat's tourniquet over all the others. They're small. If you, if you unstring it, you can run it through your belt loops and carry it with your belt so that you've got a tourniquet with you uh, all the time. And this thing cinches down to where you can get it on a, a child's limb or even an animal, you know, like your, your dog. Um, whereas a, a cat, you can't, you can't get that thing down tight enough to stop the blood flow, but with this you can. So anyway, that fits down in there. Uh, obviously, you know, it's a magazine pouch for pistols will fit down in there, double stacks there on that. So that's that end. On this end, it's just a larger open single pouch here. And generally what I've carried in this has been either a, a Garmin GPS or a pair of um, binoculars, the really small binos that fit down in here nicely. And so that's just a pouch to carry, you know, whatever. Inside the bag, the first thing you'll notice as you're looking at it is this thing, right? This is a flap that Velcro's open and it allows uh, an antenna to come up in the event that you have a radio down in here or that you need to run uh, comms out, maybe an earpiece or uh, external microphone. The only thing I really added to this is heat shrink tubing and 550 cord on the zippers. Just makes it where you can grab it easier. All right, so speaking of the inside, that is the pouch that is specially designed for the radio that would marry up right over the top here and the antenna would come out of the top, right? It could be a sat phone antenna. It could be uh, you know, a radio, just standard radio, whatever you want it to run, just drops down in there. Kind of a thin area back here. Got a larger open pouch pocket right in the front and the center. And then there is a third slot right here and generally what I put in that third of uh, the what I put in these would be 
you know, a tablet. I'll stick that down in the back. Chem lights, whatever you want goes right in there. And then this side, it's got soft Velcro in here where you can you know, stick uh, a holster, you know, in here and have your gun where you can easily access it. That's pretty much that, that bag. This is the travel bag that I've used for forever and a day and still use it to this day.